If you are venturing into the cryptocurrency world, there is too much information to learn that can be confusing. That doesn't have to be the case. In this channel, we strive to simplify crypto so you don't have to struggle to understand it. Welcome to the Crypto Andy channel, where we cover everything cryptocurrency. We give you the latest news, reviews, and research to help educate you in the fast evolving cryptocurrency space. In today's episode, we shall discuss Arweave. We will define what exactly Arweave is, Arweave's latest developments, core technological innovations, tokenomics, use case, and development team. So let's uncover these topics one by one. What is Arweave, the latest developments? Arweave is a new type of storage that backs data with sustainable and perpetual endowments, allowing users and developers to truly store data forever. Simply put, Arweave is a type of blockchain storage. In Arweave's words, it's a collectively owned hard drive that never forgets. Arweave is excited to announce that they have raised $8.3 million in additional funding from Anderson Horowitz and USV and new funding from Coinbase Ventures. This money will be reinvested into the AR community. Out of this funding round, we'll start two big initiatives for the community, Arweave Grants, where all community members can submit proposals for projects, startups, DAOs, and even marketing initiatives to further the adoption of Arweave. Any new and exciting and viable protocol adoption-driven activities will receive money out of these funds. Arweave Boost is also launching. This offering for any project, startup, or company looking to boost their growth with the help of reliable permanent storage can receive up to $50,000 in storage, access to the advice of core team members, mentorship, and feedback from community members. Other big news is coming from Redstone Finance. AR code is now available in the Redstone scanner. The integration with the SmartWeave tool, a blockchain scanner, will bring the SmartWeave tool to a new level even beyond what is capable by Etherscan. This improvement touches on the core objectives of efficiently retrievable information that is central to Arweave service. Besides these great pieces of news, you may be wondering how does Arweave actually store data? Core technologies. Arweave is built on four core technologies that we will briefly discuss. Blockweave, proof of access, wildfire, and block shadows. Blockweave. It allows nodes to fulfill key network functions without processing the whole chain. The first is the block hash list, a list of the hashes of all previous blocks to be verified. This allows old blocks to be verified and potentially new blocks to be evaluated immediately. The second of these concepts is the wallet list, a list of all active wallets in the system. This allows transactions to be verified without processing the block in which the last in which the last transaction is used. Using the block hash list, and wallet lists in a synchronized manner allows nodes join the network and participates in mining Weave almost immediately. Proof of Access It is Arweave's consensus mechanism and is based on proof of access and proof of work. The POA algorithm incorporates data from a randomly chosen previous block, combined with the block Weave data structure. Miners do not need to store all blocks, but rather can store any previous block incentivized by POA and wildfire forming a weave of blocks, a block weave. When a miner finds an appropriate hash, they distribute the new blocks along with the recall block to another member of the network. This allows all the other members of the network, even those without a copy of the recall block, to independently verify that the new block is valid. Wildfire. Our weave has added a layer of incentives to encourage miners to share data freely. Wildfire is a system that solves the problem of data sharing in a decentralized network by making a rapid fulfillment of data requests on the network a necessary part of participation. Peers are financially incentivized to stay well positioned in each other's ranking so that they can spend the largest amount of time efficiently mining. Block Shadows Arweave deploys block shadows in order to minimize waste of data, enable fast block consensus, and massive transaction throughput. Block shadowing works by partially decoupling transactions from blocks and only sending between nodes a minimal block shadow that allows peers to reconstruct a full block instead of transmitting the full block itself. Now that we have covered Arweave's core technologies, let us talk about the tokenomics, an important indicator of price action. Tokenomics First off, Arweave's native token is the AR token. It is a multi-utility token used throughout the Arweave ecosystem. Moreover, the AR token provides a crucial foundation for the network, security through incentivization. With two primary use cases, 
The Air token rewards network miners and pays for data upload fees within the network. Network miners must first store and serve data to mine fresh AR tokens. Furthermore, a participant in the network can use the same crypto wallet address for being both a user and a miner. Our Weaves reported having a capital of $1.9 billion as of 2nd February, including a total supply of 64.5 million, a circulating supply of 50 million, and a maximum supply of $66 million. And as of the making of this video, the AR token is valued at $40.46 compared to the other cryptocurrencies. With tokens in the billions, the AR token does have price potential that could go into the thousands because of its relatively low max supply of 66 million. Another important factor in its price is its use case for the AR token, which would cause demand to increase for the token raising its price. Use Cases I will list some of the main use cases that Arweave has and could have. Permanent Storage The main goal of Arweave is to provide permanent storage in the decentralized manner like cloud computing but without its single point of weakness, aka the permaweb. This is incentivized with economic incentives that reward miners for fast storage retrieval times. At a high level to appreciate what decentralized storage could do for people and business around the world, we have to understand that it establishes trust. Embezzlement by bad actors would be very difficult and easily found out if the information stored was available in a decentralized manner, stored permanently and retrieved efficiently. Legacy information can be stored here for future generations, like albums, family history, things of sentimental or knowledge value. Estate or trust can permanently store records on AR. The storage of payments like Solana are currently saved on AR, and if you want more information about that, you can watch the Solana video I made about them. Partnership with the mainline DeFi cryptocurrency will absolutely rise the demand and price of the AR token. Also, potentially, the overall storage of Web 3.0 could be done on Arweave. Basically, anything that needs permanent storage with high levels of verifiable trust and efficient retrieval can be stored on Arweave. Last but not least, let's talk about the development team that founded Arweave. Development Team Arweave was founded by William Jones and Sam Williams. William Jones is an entrepreneur and co-founder of Arweave. He's passionate about digital freedom, trustless system governance, and crypto economics. He attended the University of Kent, and his main skills revolve around cognitive science, data science, machine learning, statistical modeling, and high-performance computing. Sam Williams is a co-founder and chief executive officer at Arweave. He is a specialist in decentralization, cryptocurrency, Erland, and operating systems, and he is of German descent. Sam and William met at the University of Kent and dropped out to start Arweave while pursuing their PhDs. If you've stuck with me until the end, then kudos to you. You truly have proved your loyalty to the crypto community and my channel. So, do you think the information I shared today was worth your time? If yes, don't forget to hit that like button to show me your support. Also, comment below. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.